What a win today against MK Dons, a big difference in Tuesday's game against Newport. What did Matt have to say after the game? Um, just, he was delighted with us, to be honest with you. Um, Papa John's games are always a little bit a little bit different um, to, to league games, um, atmosphere-wise, crowd-wise, and I think every 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 club in, in the tournament makes makes a lot of changes, and and we especially give give young players a, a chance in that game. So it's a little bit disjointed, squad-wise. But listen, we, we performed pretty decent on Tuesday. Um, conceded two poor goals, but listen, we were fantastic today. Um, put in a big performance um, in front of a big crowd, and listen, I thought we dominated the game throughout, throughout 90 minutes. Um, Jamal's made a big save for the first half, which <coughs> was a big let off for us. Um, but f apart from that, I thought we were pretty comfortable. Talking atmosphere, does it make a big difference when the big bank is ba bouncing like that? Of course, yeah. Listen, it's 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 what we want. Um, you don't really want to be coming coming here and echo. Uh, you can hear your own voice echo in, in the stadium. So uh, footballers want to play in front of big crowds and noisy crowds and. And that's what the big bank does does for us, and it gives us a gives us a, gives gives us a lift, um, especially if we're defending a, a corner or a rope backs are against the walls for for a period of time in the game. And listen, the big the big bank has been brilliant, but over the last couple of years of getting behind us in tough times, and they seem to be continuing that this season. Obviously, you mentioned Jamal's save earlier in the game. That's five clean sheets now this season. How do you rate the defensive work? Obviously, I know you're you're a big part of it yourself. Yeah, no. Listen, we, we've um, we've obviously got a new goalkeeper this year. He's kind of fitted in pretty, pretty well, pretty comfortable. Um, listen, he's a big fella, isn't he? So I think it's going to be pretty difficult to get the ball past him. Um, and listen, we've done our job. We, we've we've stepped up when, we, when we've had to uh, last week at Arkerton. We put our bodies on the line a good few times. Jamal had, didn't have a lot to do last week, and he had he had something to do this week, and and he came out on top and. I think the man manager will say that's what he gets paid for, and and, and he's right. But listen, he, he's a big, big, big fella, and he's a big presence in our box. And five clean sheets, and we're looking to get double figures every season. And, and this season is no different. Obviously, coming to you, one off the post this season, another one uh, claw off the line. When are we going to see the famous Sweeney goal? I don't know, mate. Um, <laughs> I'm, I just want to get one more. If I get to twenty, I'll, I'll retire happy. Um, <laughs> 20 goals as a defender is not too bad, but listen, I've been been a little bit unlucky over the last couple of weeks, couple of months with chances and stuff, and it, I'd be a bit worried if I wasn't getting chances and, and I wasn't hitting the post or I wasn't getting on the end of things, so hopefully it'll drop to me and, and I'll just get a little two-yard tap in, so I don't really mind, as long as we get clean sheets, I don't mind who's Lovely, it's good to hear. Obviously, you got a week now until your next game, obviously first midweek off, obviously not for you, because I know you had your baby, <laughs> but uh, what's the preparation going to be like now with uh, seven days off? Um, yeah, we've we've got we've been given an extra day off, so we're off Sunday, Monday. Um, we'll come in Tuesday and train train hard like we always do every week, um, and we'll just prepare as normal. Um, going for Charlton, Charlton's going to be a, a really difficult game. Um, we obviously know our manager from from last year from Swindon, and he, he's taken a couple of Swindon players with him. And listen, we know Jaden Stockley very well, and he's going to be a vocal point for them, and and they're going to try and play some some nice football and. It's a big stadium, it's probably a Premier League stadium, um, big massive club and, and they'll have a big following and it's going to be a first time experience probably for, for a lot of us, a lot, lot, lot of our young lads playing in front of a big crowd, a big stadium, a big club so looking forward to it but we're, we're more than happy with how we started in League One and we're putting ourselves about and we've got to be happy with where we are at the minute and, and we go there full of confidence.